Let's see how we can use a network manager to manage your LAN network and also your WAN network uh, under the firewall of gold. Let's tap on network. This is your network manager. Its primary role is to configure um, your LAN and WAN network segments. So we can tap on our current WAN uh, segments. You're going to see it run in DHCP mode. It's in port 4. And you can tap on port forwarding to turn on and off UPnP if you want or add uh, additional port forwarding. And the firewall of VPN is an automatic network created by the firewall of VPN server. So you really don't have much information here. Um, the Cisco LAN network uh, is port three, connect to a Cisco switch. And here are the details. And you can even look into this segment as four devices and you can see the different transfers. And the fun thing, you can click anywhere on the graph and it will bring you the different connections the devices inside the segment uh, is, is trying to do. So you see 11 a.m. and 12 p.m. It's pretty fun looking at these things. And the number of devices here is, you have four different devices. So first you have a ubiquity access point and a Meraki access point and Firewall and the Gold 2, which is pretty much testing devices. To configure a network manager, let's tap on Edit. And let's change the DNS server of the Cisco LAN network segment. Tap on the LAN, Cisco LAN network, network segment and search for primary DNS server. Uh, let's add another DNS server. Tap on this blank area. So I want the secondary one to be 1.1.1. Tap on Done. Tap on done. Let's create an additional WAN network. Let's tap on create network. I want to create a WAN network. It's DHCP. And it's on port one. Done. So now we'll have two ISPs, ISP1 and ISP2. And they're operating a multi-WAN setting of failover mode. You can tap on failover. You can do load balancing or failover. Tap on done. Uh, we actually don't have two uh, ISPs, so we just cancel that. And now we can try to create a LAN segment. When we tap on Edit again, Create Network. So there's three different kinds of LAN. The first one is raw. Uh, you can create a LAN or VLAN segment. Uh, when you create it, there's no rules. Uh, below that is guest network and lockdown network. These are special network templates. When you create a guest network, um, the guest network can't access any local LAN. And the lockdown network is pretty much block all and allow some. Let's just create a VLAN network, for example. Tap on uh, create VLAN, and LAN 1 is fine. And let's change the type to VLAN. Let's give a VLAN uh, 11. And this is on port 1 again. Uh, I'm OK with the, the, the random IP selection, but let's change it to 11.1. Right, so everything changed afterwards. You're pretty much done. Um, save. Done. So now we'll create a LAN 1, which is on port 1 and uh, has a VLAN ID of 11.